Alright, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Camping 100 Days. We are currently on 3 and 4. Um, this is going to be probably one of the fast-paced ones because uh, we have done quite a lot this episode. So, enjoy the video, guys. If you guys already know the deal. If you guys want to see more, make sure to leave a like. Also, hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel. Join the Iron High today. Hit that notification bell as well. It's been said, guys. Later. So, this is going to be very uncomfortable. Okay. So, where we left off, we were literally talking about the fact that uh, we need to go and wait for the night for certain shit. Because I just had to literally remember that since we're literally heading out here to grab shit, and God Almighty, we have reached... The Priscillian. Hello. Hello, motherfucker. Fuck your ass. Come here. Come here, bitch. Come here, bitch. Mm. Give me your string. Give me your string, motherfucker. Ooh. Give me your eyeball. We were just talking about the fact that we needed string for arrows. And most importantly, a fishing rod. We were just talking about that. Thank God I mentioned it. Judging by my sight, but my sight has deceived me. Um, I thought I saw a skeletor, but no, I only saw a cow, which I will literally kill right now. So, uh, where we left off, we literally just had to do everything else uh, upon the sun, and now we're about to come out here into these damn woods to kill these motherfuckers. What's up? Give me, give me your goddamn it. Give me your goddamn it. Mm. All right, anyone else? Oh, hello, more. Give me your goddamn webbing. I need it. And good thing we actually needed it. Because the one thing for sure, I was going to literally use it. Because one thing we need is a bow. Because we already have two, two arrows as it is. So that's not a problem. And also, we, since we have a couple of them, we need one for a fishing rod. Because we're going to be going fishing. Which, oh, that works for us wondrously. So... Now, I think if I'm not mistaken, there is at least a few things that we have to remember here. Um, not much, and I forgot to see. Hang on a second. Okay, my bad. I just remembered my next topic. But back to what I was saying. So what we need now is that we definitely need to start digging. Um, we need to start digging into uh, a mine. But since we're already going across the map and literally doing everything else, why don't we explore the rest of the map and see where we're going from here? And uh, we'll probably just go and do that while we're at it. But uh, since we already have everything, uh, we're pretty much solid from here. So let's grab our things and uh, move on. So as uh, I forgot to tell y'all, um, I actually got a new controller. Now, um, surprisingly, this was just from Amazon. It was custom made. If you guys can look at it, <laughs> it doesn't have, uh, if you look at the controller's design here, it doesn't have it on this side. It have it on the console controller itself. So there is a very slight chance that uh, the controller's design may or may not malfunction in the game. So if it does, I'm going to have no other choice but to switch back to the other controller. But that's perfectly fine since uh, it's not really that bad and I don't have really any problems doing that anyway. So um now what we're gonna do right now is we need to climb up this reason being fuck's sake i literally dropped the couple um the reason we need this is because we're going to need to go up here and uh we're gonna grab this tree and uh we'll be on our merry way towards the other path so uh let's see so we should be going this way obviously um, or no, 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 not towards the water. Towards this way. Okay, so we're going straight towards this way, and we're entering into the huge, huge part of this island. Okay. Well, at least we're not going through, uh, the place that we just literally went through to grab, uh, some webs from those spiders. Uh, that's a good sign from us. Yeah, it's a good thing I literally didn't go that way. Ooh, God. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, I'm not going that way. Sweet Mary, mother of God. All right, so uh, since we are going this way, we're going to uh, might as well see what we're dealing with. 
So judging by where we're, eh, where we are, I'm having such a hard time speaking. Um, but anyways, judging by where we are, we should be at least heading towards the right direction. So we're going up this mountain. Like I said, uh, going through this map is going to be difficult. The reason I say that is because since we're in the unlucky zone, the chance of literally hitting a goddamn village is almost near, damn near impossible. So we have to be very much ready to do this. Uh, and that means very much quickly, because otherwise we're just going to be literally in one of the worst cases we're going to be in, which is probably death. And judging by the woods that we are already trailing on, um, yeah, we're about to be on the trail of death in about a few seconds. Which is not a good sign, but eh, I digress on that one. So, uh, we're going to go this way. Make our way over here. Uh, it doesn't seem like a lot here. I mean, I could have actually went down the other way, but eh, I'm not going to actually make the toughest case down here. I wouldn't go that far. So, that's not much of a problem for me. My biggest problem is literally trying to go through the land. Now, if you guys are probably wondering why it's lagging in this side, it's because the world is loading as of currently. And speaking of which, we were just talking about a cave. Now, now that that's a landmark we can actually use, thank God, uh, we'll worry about that, like I said, in a later episode. But we also found moss and pretty much another deserted part of the island not bad not bad so we've reached the other surface of the land which is not particularly bad in our end so this makes it 10 times better now um as we are going down here judging by the looks of it we found more foxes which is so goddamn adorable but also we have more sugar cane it makes this a lot more easier to go and travel now, um, looks like we have another lane or land that we have to go in here. So, let's take our behinds all the way over there again. Alright, let's go down here. That should be able to clear the place we're supposed to go. It seems like we're running into a lot of underwater caves by the looks of it. We're going to need some potions. And the reason I said we need some potions is because... My guy, we're really going to need extras if we're going to be making our way out of here. Fa la 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 la. I'm so, so terrified for us. Just for this reason. Sweet Jesus, I didn't even realize that this was not even the fucking land we was going to go on. Okay, yeah, this is a... Uh, it's not a good sign for any of us. But, here's a good sign. Cool! <laughs> Because once we head to a somewhat village, because we're definitely, I'm not going to hold you, we are definitely traveling a away from this map after we literally collect materials. Because other than that, I'm not staying here. It is so it's such a bad idea to literally stay out here and not have anything for civilization in a base. Like, there's just no point. There's really no point. So what we're going to do here is literally just... um start getting everything else from here and then move our ways back towards over there now day three is almost ending by the way uh so we're going to move our way out of here so oh sweet baby jesus i thought i was going to fall right through the goddamn boat because they used to do that when uh last game was uh fairly updated but now that they haven't done that in a while i guess it's uh it's now an object that we can actually stand on thank god I guess they been had that, I just never really tried it, but you get my fucking point. <laughs> so, we have so much material on us, we really have to start getting a base going. But since we're not really going to be able to have enough time to get things through, I wouldn't even suggest that. So, yeah. Alright, now that we're actually going in a completely different direction, um, let's go this way. And I'm pretty sure we should be able to reach our particular part down here. Um, well, I'm going to keep that in there. So that's something a lot of our island dwelling. So that kind of pretty much fits our common factor of what we're doing here now. So it's not too much. 
I would say. Kind of just sums up our issues that we're probably going to be having in the future. So, there's that. Setting up a base on an island is not exactly our best forte, but in 100 days, I'm pretty sure we wouldn't be here for that long. Especially considering the fact that if we're just traveling and literally moving afar, we wouldn't have enough time to literally, like, salvage everything from here. So, <clears throat> in our greatest value of death, I wouldn't even suggest staying here that long. This is just an actual tip and advice. Do not stay on islands for that long, because eh, you're not going to survive that long. Especially if you do not have that much going through. The reason I say that is because if you're just doing, like, camping, um, one thing for sure, you need trading. The reason you need trading is because the more cold you have, the more you actually go through. If you do not have a certain civilization where half of it is not even in the same dwelling that you have literally performed before, there is no point of you even trying. It really is. Um, but anyways. So, let us continue on on our way. And we will move ourselves directly out of here. And, uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure this is, uh, will probably be part of the map that's going to be towards the end. So, that means we're probably more than likely to go through the birch area of this in order to get outside the map eh, which again i'm not really surprised by at all and there you go there are baby zombies down below what a surprise now um as we're going through this map i just realized this is probably already towards the end of the map so let's take ourselves over here and see if that is it and then we will do a landmark over here for certain maps and i think we'll be very much solid um but anyway um let us take ourselves all the way out of here and go directly to the other side of the forest so that way uh we can literally go and just see what's over there because it seems like uh, the part of the water, it's going straight towards that other side. So we'll definitely go over there. Okay, so now that we actually did make it back here, let's move our way towards this way now. Now, judging by the water area that we're looking at here, it looks like there's nothing here. But I'm not testing that. I'm not trusting that either. So let's go straight and see if there's any land. If there's not a single amount of land, and I think we have... Ooh. There is a ship there. Something tells me I'm not having a pleasant day. Okay, so there's nothing there. Let's, uh, let's reach our map this way. And we'll go this way. See if there's any land around this part. And I think we'll be pretty much solid. Uh, as I feared... My gut instincts may be right. I think. Wait. Ooh, wait. Please tell me we have reached land. Please tell me we have reached land. Okay. A little piece of land. Let's take a look. Eh. Thanks, buddy. Now. Let's go through this way first before we go anywhere further. Yep, as I expected. This is the land that we were actually looking for. Okay, I was right. Now, I don't know if it's dark yet because I haven't checked my, um, my, um, and the sun is completely out. So, or yeah, yeah, the sun is literally, literally not even showing. So as a result, no, I can't even, oh, fuck's sake. Come on, give me that, give me that. Get back up. Okay. So, I, again, like I said, I'm not entirely sure. So, um, what we're going to do here is we're just going to... um, Because we're pretty much going to be on the end time of this. So, as a result, let's take our asses directly to a place where we could set up, set up camp. Which is just right here. Um, and there's a wandering trader. 
So we have reached civilization as far as anything. Okay, so I was right. So it was literally not that far off. Hmm. That should be interesting. Well, I got something to ask of y'all, since uh, this is how far they're going to get us. Should I go off the rails and off the map and just continue on my survival life and my camping life <laughs> on here, or should I go back to the islands? That will be up to y'all in the comments below. And, okay. Okay. I just wasted my food. It's almost getting dark. I need to start sing for camp now! And let me guess, I lost all my wood, didn't I? Hopefully I didn't lose all my sticks. That worked for me. Alright, let's see. But also, let me grab my crafting table and I think I should be able to have everything. Let's go right here. Should have everything, but... Oh, fuck. Uh, yeah, I'm needing another extra set of wood. Fucking brilliant. Alright, so that means cutting this off was a good option. Good thing. All right. All right. And I'm going to set up my bed. <sighs> well, that about settles uh, part two of this uh, today's two or maybe four days in and uh we have found land so that's a good sign so uh i'm gonna end it here hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys do make sure to leave a like also hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel this has been said guys later My, oh, oh.